assault charge, you are sentenced to five years imprisonment. For murder, you are sentenced to 30 years imprisonment. For the attempt to defeat or obstruct the cause of justice, you are sentenced to four years imprisonment. The effective sentence is therefore 32 years imprisonment. Deborah Mitchison's court was packed to capacity yet again. In the dock stood Tabanim Zolom, accused of murdering 21-year-old Zonine Kumalom, as well as possession of an illegal firearm and ammunition. The state said it intends opposing bail. As Mzolo left the courtroom, he mocked those in the gallery. It shows us that this dog doesn't have any remorse. By virtue of showing the people of the Republic of South Africa a middle finger, it tells all of us that he's prepared to kill again. I was completely taken aback that I ended up in an abusive relationship and I can't believe I mean I still can't believe that I was in one and but it was a relationship where I, I dated him for five months and the first bruises I saw was when I got a restraining order yeah. so I um, and then, of course, three weeks later, he came and beat me up. For the longest time after after the abuse, uh, I I let it define me, and I carried it around with me everywhere I went. Cheryl Zondi says she was raped by Timothy Omotozo, founder and senior pastor of the Jesus Dominion International Church. It allegedly happened in Durban. A sea of red t-shirts to symbolize the bloodshed by women at the hands of men. This is an anti-femicide uh, march to commemorate uh, the memory of Rifilele Debele, our friend, who was brutally murdered. Uh, we just want women to raise up and speak out. The Debele family is still struggling to come to terms with the untimely death of their daughter. It is time that we wake up and we become real men. God created us as heads and God said we must protect our women and not kill them. Uh, let's not behave like boys who are kicking uh, um, balls around. The Violence Against Women in South Africa, a country um, in crisis report, was released last week by the Centre for the Study of Violence and Reconciliation and Oxfam SA. It, it actually found that 40 to 50 percent of men disclosed uh, of having perpetrated physical partner violence and one in five women older than 18 has experienced physical violence and also three women die at the hands of their intimate partner every day. Tumelangral amakhela mo daily teta on SABC1. Nakalibitso ke na Nicolette wa Ramashile ngwana wa kwa Bosch pa Krishma Pulaneng. E a tola kanga matsogeni ke sesi fortune wa ga madlala. Esli di bonele on the insert. A report by the United the United Nations says that almost 35% ya basadi ba molofaseng ka have reported or have been abused physically sexually, psychologically, in every single manner possible by a person who's supposed to be the partner, someone supposed to protect them and love them. These are our uncles, our fathers, our brothers, and sometimes young little boys are being shown for abuse and you know all sorts of physical abuse are okay. One in eight women in South Africa gets killed every single day. So no question do we have a society of broken men? in this country. When will I be one of the eight that gets killed by my partner? That's what we're talking about. I'm going to join the conversation. I'm going to ask you, 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 I'm going to Join our conversation and use the hashtag Daily Teta or you can call 011 339 when a man stabs his wife 17 times, what does that mean? I don't even know because I've never been in that situation. But in Kabangu to Tlalalam Sanje, Ilonozo sees actually dive deep to a month basis just to find out why are they so broken. Maybe it's some conversation as Ngayaz, Enz Agalayo, behind closed doors. That's what we're talking about, Nam Sanje. But as well, come along, come to Kona with Delicia Tlalalam Sanje. Welcome to Delicia Tlalalam and even my hashtag on social media that men are trash. When I think um, basically it's 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 a it's a mentality. Mm. Understand? That's a problem. Uh, females think they are more superior than males. 
I feel okay, that. Yeah. And however, it sort of like uh, hurts a young man, you understand? Mm. You mm. cannot call me trash. Mm. It really hurts. I'm a human being at the end of the day, yeah. you understand? So I feel like these are issues that we have to address and the government has to address the, um, the interest of young men in South Africa, mm. men in particular. Let me just put it that way. But now we, 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 we often see about basically it's a young men, like you're saying, but we clip as well. Uh, we go up to the police station. We go up to the police station. We go up to the police station. We go up to I think those are things that we that happened in 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 the um, in the back room that mm. we don't see. You understand? Mm. And another thing is that people fight in the back room, and uh, we want to sort of like um, be the judgments of what happened after that. Yeah. Another thing is that I feel that. Um, Women, as I said, it's 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 a mentality of superiority, and we sort of like undermine a man, and it it, it, it makes me angry. I don't know. Uh, maybe I'll find out. Go come back and tell you what is it that enga undermine our mutual Lisa as a born guti the solution into it. Go to tate umpefumloa. It, 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 it really is very sad, Kini, because we are told that men and women are equal. But it seems as if there is somebody else who wants to assert power over another person. Is there ever a good enough reason? The way back. Mm. The way mm. the way I was upbringed with together with my my younger sister. Hunali Koko Mohai and Koko Haru Hudisa. The discipline is not the same. Ha when I as a girl child gone through when they mistake the treatment it becomes a little better lesser compared to mine as as a as a boy child. Who to balin to an hour umanam shimani tama uluzwa uluitwanet. Remember, Koko or Gonna Kita Gutu Kita with this thing yahore mamma umbeti legon. Then Haki Fita Kontru Kuku Abare Umuna Tama Uluitwane. The thing. Kito fit a staging sahore, kikena in a dating stage. Kikena with the mentality and the concept yahore, I'm a man, I must maintain my ego as a man. Then kitonyu luhaliona until become a man, a CEO of a certain company. But now because of the way I was upbringed, I must maintain the ego, yahore, I'm a man. We cannot look at it now say yet because more as long as it is an ending, Okay. Well I mean the question we need to be asking then seeing as we know all these excuses and radegua, yeah. or is the way I'm raised, or I come from trauma, or it almost feels skinny as if we have to sit every single one of each man problem 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 solve. How do we break the cycle? I think in the ballegele go to before sip kalesa zasi ngene go to conversation. Mele skalesa zogo to yin lens agala because this is what we call a job show. Zasu wa fuga na patu bamba fega as well. Unene sini zata fungu skaza la sano go to why abantu besli sabai lens la ba yona namtange because it's inuna kugonga shuma zaga but besli fazane and shuma zaga ne ingane as well. Yeah, you know, kona intengi ibi zogo to is the psychology of power. Namaya majui. Is, is to understand the difference between a man and a man. A man is CEO, the authority is seven. But man figure like how the authority of corner changes mm. is the authority of a father and a husband. Mm. But man figure how situations are fun and good in the last level of seven. Mm. I still have to come back home and be a father and a husband. But man, I'm a father and a husband. Don't ask me benzi. Don't ask me to marry anyone. Isn't that says as says they like her economically, you know? So it it threatens mm. the authority. I'm. So what I do then the power. Mm. Yeah, but because authority is institutionalized, yeah. but if power, you can use it anyway. Mm. So do you think that actually we are contributing to 
as many as a crime as is born a weapon about basically suffers good because I don't have um sevens I'm not really young John Jack was and was a provider because my role is to provide like her quick one before they break it exactly that's why I need it's a psychology yeah. because we're not into I have to provide yeah so I must do it by any means necessary mm. yeah okay so we're going to tell you to tell us if you want give us a call a card it's 011 339 1315 season to mono coaching about want to find out exactly um yombo a band of this Lisa would be but we'll enjoy but pull in the and how can you fix the situation as well? Yes, that's what we're going to be looking at after the break. Whatever the passion, whatever you want to imagine, so just let in the passion, pretend that we're living a lavish so As far as dreams, you never let your dreams go. We tired of listening to you, we rising from the dirt. Let's make them panic, rising off the youth that don't know how to folks and they know where the kids are to go. Daily tents are breaking the barriers. Oh, oh. Daily Teta, celebrating Youth Month. Welcome back to Daily Teta. I'm Sanjay's book about broken men. And how can we move forward? How can we not wake up every morning? My headlines are Kuluma Pat, Aban Best Lisa, Aban Limaz, Aban Best Fazan, Aban Yeba Babaz, but the as well. Uh, let me come to you, Mdao. I want to find out your point because you had something. Uguti Gassin Skati, Aban Best Fazan, they provoke men. Uguti Babel, Aban Best Lisa, Abai Bon and Amsanj. Tell us the story. Egama promise, Mdao. Enga go show abafaz ba shaya. Ese kushaya ile uzu hamba e police stage. Yeah. Ma ufiga ma police a kushaya kanje uba ala etai unazotla langa tibu ela uelu insinda ba yakono faz wa kwenye. Hmm. Ma ufiga la pana geenza sha no ma yestina no ma yini no ma oma kielo ane. Yeah. Enga be 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 kupona gim lokia. Hmm. Ba 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 kuchata from gim uti ah wa hamba e police stage ama police ati a kushaya ala lok. Hmm. So oma oma ba ti a mina shaya unfaz. Hmm. Menage aye umkiz impela impela ni yake nchini umfazi, so sebe zaini zaloko. So logo usi chuguti kuna ngalu kulumenda aga zamu de luni sema police station chuguti umfazi ma nzi into epuma nzelen, aga aga kuzwe. Kuna pongo tu aya matu tayi warong aya indo tanga aya boshi. So you saying guti ni naban basically sa umani zobiga usi zile nema police ni aya nslega na lego loko sani bonu guti ni spinsele lakban basically fazan. But our cabang in good text in a conk and subola lumon to Nanga and a conalap on a took Telawa. No, you will show with the Indo and Agumele, you lose some way of Hulumende or Amapolis and Alu with the eye. Mount on Faz will to shine daughter. No miscue was unconscious in a call, she called the water when a square was back on. Okay, Nicolet as well go to Chidum Tower or Mosang or Tlaku, Cabang with Ba Provo, Cogles and Dabazenza. I think before we carry on the conversation, Arunel Hone, let's, let's remember, and I would like to, but with all due respect, let's take this seriously because at the end of the day, we can't have a conversation about abuse and make jokes about mm. it. It's mm. very important. We do have a, a social media coming in from Pilani Pils Mobo. Apartheid created this. Over 300 years of brutal colonialism have created the African man who has never been, who has never controlled their fate. Their fate has always been at the whim of the oppressor. The frustration he encounters because of the current system ends up building up and exploding in the face of their loved ones. Now we're all in apartheid, men and women. Let's speak to Butkolani. Butkolani, tell us a little bit about the story, Sahaw. Uh, yeah. Mm. So there's this sex ten relay a caban retrojale. And then like I think Lena na hat it's the one shapagati. So it's a robala at this side or rats work robet mo, which is on a trial on harmony. So now quick to a bale a bale lantrum. The time a bale lantrum kim totsim ya kogam shapal planka, which is uh parents saga delayed I intervene. Mm. Like they were negli aggressive cutting about interviewing and about mm. a mm. Like uh, they were not quite letting Kilega end up, Kinwale, like Murano or whatever. Mm. They were not battling Shapa cutting, like in Batla Moon. Mm. Yeah. So uh, uh, take us through Hu Shapa, Hu Mushapa, what is going through your mind? Let's even go back to the first time Umushapa. What was going through your mind at that time? No, like Nantre Nelkele Longyak. Like now, I'm going to go to the house. 
So na like uh, eh, I felt like kin to a right vele like um sharp mm. So at what point did you realize Hore, this is not the right behavior? This is wrong. Uh Kerlas de Unamo Kim Chaplin thing like uh Tola miscarriage mo. Young one hour how? Yeah. Then Kimo Bonin thing or wrong Tam like stop it. Do you think you'll ever abuse another woman? Uh, no. Why not? I've learned my lesson, Jay. Kayo Nantrio, we are miscarriage and stuff. So that situation, your miscarriage, was enough to correct everything a wee born in Hula. Was it enough to correct it? Uh, not really enough, Jay, because next time it's like a lag in Bola, Jay. Mm. Yeah. Utok Letus? Uh, Clock Letus. Baba, Utusakaman. Uh, counseling young more from Mogulan mm. Yeah. And I think, Queen, that's what we, we need to talk a little bit about, Hori. Yes. I've got reasons, and, and perhaps maybe they're justified. Mm. But when do we determine what is right and what is wrong? When you talk about justified, I'm just asking myself, the right, or oh, maybe to correct yourself and say, uh, because of this, of this, I can do it as well. Mm. But uh, Joseph, next to me, you have some of the reasons that you think are Yes. Okay, uh, I believe as men, we've been given the authority. By uh, no, by being a man, you okay. know and power would say, this is the family you need to take care of yeah so again it goes back to a pressure mm. as men because if ubaba everybody's looking after what do you do yeah if you understand so uh, i feel what we need to align ourselves with the universe right now mm. because there are a lot of things as in Zagalai. Mm. women they've got power now mm. i mean you go to parliament they've got big positions mm and kids about social media. So as soon as we understand what you know, so we need to align, we need to adjust ourselves. But please guys, let's not put pressure on ourselves. Yes, you've been given the position, but if you feel good now, it's too much for you. Mm. You need to step out. So you think Uti Umnabim Lamp and M sevens because if you look at the level of unemployment linings in Africa, it's very high. Local ones go to about Bisley Sababa Lenta Bayona Baba no Lame, Bafunugulwa, Abanya Baba to Nebez the Bebe Zike Beng or Bekageza, just because there is the pressure for them to, to provide as men. Yes, that's true. Uh, in fact statistically by Cheki Luguti, most of our Baba Banga Sebenzi, in fact they're losing that power as Ubaba, you know. Mm. We end up not knowing what he it's like we guest, you understand, because of you can't provide. So it's very vital, Uti, we need to engage Nama Men's Forum. So yes, we are building that forum as we speak now, Eval, whereby uh, we're trying to engage Nabo Baba. We've checked the rate of Baba Baba separately. Guma marriages, Naguma, where they're cohabitating, but they separated because of so, such reasons. Okay. So it's very important to uh, see focus in us. I when a situation you grew up without love and that book damaged cool. Tell us more about that. Yeah, it did. You know, when I was about eight years old, my parents separated, mm. and I'm the only boy child at home. I have two younger sisters. Yeah. And when they separated, my uh, father sub subsequently remarried. Mm. So my stepmother was very abusive towards me mm -hmm. as the, the eldest male child in the house. So What do you mean abusive? Physically and emotionally. Mm. Sometimes I would be denied the opportunity to go to school. Mm. I would be forced to clean toilets. I would be forced to cook at a young age. Mm -hmm. You know. Let's and fast forward to 2018. Local um, I think in a way it built me instead of crushing me. Mm. I have never uh, abused a woman in my life. Mm. I've also established a mentorship program for boys. I mentor boys from 14 to 21 years of age yeah. because I want to groom them in, in different areas of their lives. I grew up with so much anger like him, mm. but I decided to confront that anger. Mm. And How do you confront your anger? Um, you need to visit yourself inside and know where you want to go as a man and understand why certain things happen to you. Mm. Um, I, I'm one person who believes that everything that happens in a person's life, yeah. there's a purpose, there's a reason. So I had to understand that I was being built and I'm, I'm not the only person who's yeah. going through those challenges. So many people about Kulenjang, they end up damaged, but when now you're saying you change that negative into a positive, was it because of church, people around you? 
um so in the midst of me being abused by my stepmother she would also force us to go to church and oh. she didn't know that by doing so she was actually getting uh, my relationship with god to be so strong yeah so i held on to that and i was a very i'm a stubborn uh, believer and yeah. very uh, i believe so much in faith and i end up so you, you agree in saying in shaping a band basically so good to baba band about no one not good about best but about no one in a way uh, because some of these things are not taught in our families yeah. so a church is also a family system mm. and that's where uh, you have pastors and you have mentors who groom you I ended up being a social worker myself mm. so the profession itself also channeled me to be a better man in all areas of my life and that's why I started let me give back to the community and do something for a boy child okay we are going to collect this it's, it's a beautiful story guys to whatever negative we're going to again our chat talk pendula go by positive and local gum sizile and we're going to look at inda by sonto as well we're going to have a power pastor just to find out could he sonto limi shape a ganja numi tosli so good abe umto nyonyana empagatil i feel like we're having a lot of uh and and big ups to you my brother but when i pr answers mona garen nita aiba totwa aren saying nita but what i'm doing are you what they will come or we talk of men's egos as if it's the most important and sacred thing in the world that's why we can't call our brothers out for their abusive behavior. Men aren't held accountable even as boys for their actions. Question Who is responsible for the man's ego? And if, if they're saying their egos are the reasons why they abuse, who is supposed to take care of that ego? Please do stay with us after the break. it's very bad for women to be abused I'm a daughter because like as an individual I mean I've been through that so I think because of the things that we go through Tina as women during that abuse are the things less as change how you Tina to be about to a phone by evil it's very upsetting when you how I'm not one me it's a very bad feeling for protection. Hello, Girls have this thing you would see um if um fana agang shy, agang tandy. So in a way, I may have later, but like it, it comes to an extent good by a bulalo and Angaz good Baba Shaila and Vel. Angaz, I don't know what goes through their minds. Sometimes it has to do with how they grew up. It depends on each man. I may have daughter could experience abuse from their household. So then, but could have got a right or that affected them negatively. So basically, I could have got a bad answer. You embarrass me, Zabo. So it depends. Go muti no muti go to why. Sometimes it's just it's a trend. Go to know about first these days by abuse or they see that as something mainly to do. So it depends. Go daughter individually, respectively. I think all men that abuses their women or even those who have not started, if you feel good, uh, there's something that is hurting you with relationship or whoever lady that has hurt you, please seek counseling because I mean, I'm not the person who hurt you before. So I think good men should go for counseling and stop killing women. No one as parents, so I like if really don't have the issues as parents, so I'm gonna risk a lot of my pillow because by income from there, or by the end, I'm gonna have a whole lot of money, and then even to me, I said I could. It's just to say to pay all the rest of the money. Kiri me lor haba ka hudi swa kala rato le ka shompo kini tuza ba tlo diye sa haba hula hure kuhusu sisi na sika me agatwa le pele chini kwa ni. Like how Saba Ruti Balbanyan and Hanan Twitter Loka, so by Tamil Kaladi Tikolo, Mukaladi Kirke, Lekamala Ping. 
Welcome back to Daily Tet and Zerlevelna a South African men a broken society. Why Babulaya? Why Bateya? You know, often Musadi Rebamatea they ask the question, Hori, why did she stay? Mm. Now today I want to challenge the men and ask them, why if Musadi is disrespecting you to appoint your Ubat Nankomatea Kapahom Molaya, why do you stay? That's what we're going to be talking about Lukono Mora Daily Teta. And also, we're taking your calls as well. Uh, let's go to KZN. Vuyo, welcome to Daily Teta. Shabuwa na putinijani. Mko na mfuwe tu, singa za uguwe. Ya, ngi kona na amu. La, ngi nisi ntizu tuje vengu fulukshere shanga ya zopetu. Au kichi menje ngengwa iskati mfuwe tu. Ya. Wan, ugu, ankole na minuguti, mina, mina, nje nga amje ufuwe. Ya. Ugu, tukuma mina sayi nga shukumeze, kufanele mina, nshukumeze mwenye mundu. Kufanele mina, nshagize, nfige, pointi ndo kula lu mundu. I think we as men we are hiding behind Leon to go to China, she means you and that's all it does. And to go to every man who 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 yes, won't get who keep his status for now in the Nanga Shumans, so in a Kumans land. I get whom you come on this season, which means you don't see that Kashanga land. And two men are saying a Shumans in between. And as a result, a Shumans and Guami. And he's on the one moon to have him. He's on the low moon to low or until now. And gay and gay and gay in Lima Zumunu moon to and gay in the Jan Cotton Zoom to Till and Kitil and Alu moon to low. Oh, and Zalenda is of me. Someone I think, yeah, I trust a person is actually. See a tolly point like compared to Tabatamani, but Tashang is Tupa, ain't to another Zenza, Uguzabewa, Zutbas Tetel, and Savanga Voyo. Let me quickly come to Mube Mube. You have a point as well, Zulu Vutin, Telamat Mesliza, Abaning, but Tashang would Nam Nanga from Meza. What is your take of that? Okay, mm. uh, I feel like I was fortunate enough because I grew up with a father figure in front of me. Yeah. And I grew up getting a mentorship from even my father and my both my father and mother. Yeah. But now it's also not an excuse that you don't have a father figure and you have to be abusive mm. towards a woman. Mm. It's not an excuse to go to Ukulu unge na baba no manan because there are forums as far na na sema sonto. Yeah. For example, menang kwa zetu. But actually, wangu kumuto oye sonto. Nzo nzo show from good point la mimang sai sonto and then nzo show kula baba ngai sonto. Yeah. For example, mena kwa zetu Cosmos City Assemblies of God. Yeah. And Assemblies of God kuna ma kuna ma lonto za Wednesday service zamato ting kwa zetu zamato. So now not everything. My dad will teach me. We go to Mfana Lento Le One Two Three. Connect the instrument. Clap on your hands. Tint. But now, man, figure something. We don't find this. We are going to go to as Kulum. As Kulum. Oh, Baba, Baba, say something. We are going to go to Kulum. And now, for people who don't go to church, we are going to communicate. We are going to Baba, Baba, show you in my community in a way they can talk to you. But now, the problem now, challenge. We go to so we are going to Le One Two Three. We are going to go to Le One Two Three. So we are going to go to um, Aksafa Nakta Alamanji, I think we are now moving to EE Katiz Zazamanji. Maybe we get into that solution, Mangube, because we are not finding exactly what we are in 2018. We cannot apply our methods as 1980 or 1960. Right now, Spagan and King, men are broken. We want to find out exactly what can we do, especially to our pastors, Nicolette. Yeah, I was speaking to this young gentleman, Kini, during the break, and he, he said something very profound. Abrabla Katabaya culture. Sometimes culture, you know, it protects the ego. Can you? Perhaps tell us a little bit about that. Yeah, I mean, uh, I strongly believe which, uh, our culture and our religion uh, sp plays a big role. Okay. If you look at it, uh, you'll find with the culture, I mean, uh, I believe with Tumfaz is nothing. Mm. Tumfaz has to listen to me. Mm. Yeah, is I there a culture like that? There are certain cultures. What culture is that? It depends on other zone. Uh, unfortunately, I can't mention You can't mention? Okay. Yeah. Oh, okay. Because uh, we live. But no uh, matter religion, you are afraid to mention the culture that says women can is it? Yeah, I respect. I respect okay. other people's cultures mm. uh, and religions too. Mm. Uh, Kona religion, you find which they say women. Maybe I'm a Christian. I'll put it like it, if it's a church, which women are not allowed to preach. Women are not allowed to do one, two, or three in the mm. church. Yeah, one. Okay, so. perhaps we've, we've got pastors that are sitting right here with us and, and, and you know, maybe let's get a better understanding because so perhaps culture, 
Well, get to my way. Um, hopefully, and it because even what you are, um, Bibling, um, hello, Bola, Mudimutro Dile, Monala Mosad, and Monala Mosad from the Bible. When it comes to God, they are equal, and even when Mudimu Atlori Kidira Mosad from Adam, right? Mudimu Hari Adam should have dominion over the woman. He did not say that. He Urile Mosad ki help me. So, meaning everything. So Mudimu created a balance. Mara na ugerasa ikuishi sherena. We take it for now. I have to have authority over my wife. Then our family structure ito sinyer because at the end of the day, utanza kora abe balance len na as ilimu sadiwak. We are in in our own kingdom. I'm the king. She's my queen. Rebecca Holikan. When we blabli ka 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 religion. Are you kwa ka culture? I na I'm saying as a human being. You don't come to a national television and start talking about things that you cannot back up. Mm. So the issue of yaori, huna la culture yaori watu culture yaori, bom me tanziba shapiwe or bom me ba tanziba nke loko class. I've never heard of that culture, and maybe we must not even talk about it because the person not linger this discussion. I don't know who he back up, so maybe we must not even talk about it because uh, you you can't say things that you cannot support. So uh, let's, but, but, let's, let's I, not even I'm talk. I'm sorry, about I need to come in on that one because uh, I do have Ubabum uh, Loyla. He was backing him. He said yeah. there are actually a religion, a religion like that. Okay. Uh, can you can you come in on that one? Bum? We cannot come here and defend men. Mm. What else we want a solution? Men are not being the one who are being killed. The solution is that there are cultures. Have you seen this boy, Mababu, your circumcised? Mababu, the way they treat women, it's like there's something that they told them, but women are nothing to them. Even their mothers, own mothers, then their mothers must submit or be, be submissive to them. Because Babu is a daughter. That is a cultural supremacy. The only thing that needs to be told, even if it is hidden, they cannot, they cannot uh, accept that. Mm. But they need to tell, change the message that you tell this boy. Mm. When they come back, you are still a son to this mother. Mm. You are still a brother to your sisters. The only thing about South African men, we, write, we like to hide things underneath mm. and pretend as if we are not abusive. South African men are broken and abusive. Mm. South African men are killing women. Mm. I am standing here and to say I'm a former man that has been abusing women physically. Mm. Some did not abu abuse them physically, they abuse them financially. Mm. Some they abuse them verbally. Mm. I'm, I'm shy on when I'm talking to you, you know, I'm not Because it's a South African man. I'm not going to say that I'm not going to say that I'm not going to say that I'm not going to say why am I to talk about the clinic? It's now windowed because we presume we're talking about the right. Then women must submit to men. Women are not our object. We need to acknowledge that we are a broken nation, and as we are a broken nation, we need to seek help. We are very angry. Babumlo, quick one. I want to come to you as well. Oguti, we're having a discussion today. We're talking about broken men, but we always we're going on the surface. Do you think Tinama Tota si aslega ukulma ikini so si sorta without a man bes fazan? Si aslega, si aslega, because. Normal sort. I'm, I'm attending in Menon Track. I'm the member of Menon Track. Yeah. Then one day I felt to go to Yazin. I think Lendo Yam Yoshaban does Fazan. It's going beyond. No man like Abulal Mundos Fazan, the patterns of Kilamumbul and Lila. Buba Chaila. It's supremacy. Mm. Um, it, 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 there's no excuse for mm. the angry for some reason is not mm. the whatsoever be mm. Mm. Then, then I went to anger management. Mm. Anger management, management, I felt so, so embarrassed because I had to say I'm an abuser. Mm. And acknowledge, hi, Peggy, hi, mm. how are you and all these things. I am abusing women. Mm. Then I accepted that and seek help. Mm. Then men, some even in the churches, they are hiding behind the Bible. The very same pastors, they are hitting their women. Mm. The very same men of God, they are very abusive. Mm. South African men are broken. South African men are angry, and we are trying to bring this, uh, technicalities here. Mm. We need to accept the majority of us. Okay. okay. So Zoe Prekin, Jenna Manja. Well, Ozoelo Pastor Mlo Egutu Tini, if you think now we're going to something on it, we add our cellular lunch, it's so simple, give us a call. Ozoelo Egutu Tini, the hashtag is Idelitator. Yes, please do find us after the break.
Welcome back to Daily Tetas. If Valuflelo say breaking back, she's like a cool person. Keep her um lilo at a month. Best list like you'll find them goody about was a cool map about my issues about beginning now. But Ulanga next to me, what you know. Actually, I want to basically say about these things. Tell us the story of the Bakuluma Kuluma Gupi and Batin. Okay, I will now. It's a try from Lead Me, I Lead You Movement, the Kuluva in a suit. Um, I'm a total Kuluma, and what we've come to, we need to accept. We would see the question that's being posed at us. It's a difficult question to answer. What sort of thing right? about it? Because uh, at most we find we would see we're asking people who have not really been in that situation. Mm. Right, so we, we come from a point where we assume we see men do this because of one, two, three, and four reasons. Mm. However, there's men that have actually killed, we deal with men that are in conflict with the law, mm. offenders and ex-offenders. Yeah. And people that have actually done it mm. are coming out to say, Mina, this is why I killed, this is why, why I, I, I abused the woman. Why are and those, what are those reasons? Because you're telling us, yes. we are talking here, but we're not saying actually the exact reasons. In yes. there are reasons about niggas out. So, Part of the, uh, the reasons that they cite, we would see one, they would speak about anger, mm -hmm. they would speak about self hate, mm. right, and also being cowards. Mm. There's, actually, there's men that have agreed to, we would see, we, you know, I was so intimidated by this woman, I didn't know what to do with her, but just to hit her and limb it and flat out, and eventually that's how I regain my power. Mm. And normally, it's easy to have a solution to a situation that you have never been in it, mm. realistically. So now, when we go, as we are earlier talking, normally we are mm. we, we actually suggested to, we actually need to have a dialogue between men and women that have actually killed, mm. men that have abused, because those are people who have clear and, 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 and um, truthful reasons as to why they've done it. Because, Tina, you know, we come from a point of assumption. Yeah. I've never beaten a woman up. Mm. And if you're going to ask me why, I'm actually going to answer in a way that would tell me, would tell you, would say, this is why I won't do, I won't do it. I, I have a, prob I have a problem. Yeah. Uh, we need to get to people who have done it. But because now we're looking for a solution. And must we wait for um, more to be killed so that we can come up with a solution? Or we must actually try by all means to find a solution right now? No. No, right now, what we're doing, is for, for instance, in our SA movement, together with the Rich Learning Mentorship Program, yeah. we're starting with boys, right? We, would say, this is, we are mentoring them. We are taking men in society yeah. that are willing to teach these young men not to do these things. And yeah. we are taking guys, for instance, we're taking ex-offenders to yeah. engage with these young boys to say, I'm a man that has, ki has killed a woman. Yeah. And I'm saying to you, don't do it because of these reasons. Okay. So we are killing it from the root cause. And then, okay. so that's okay. the aim. Because of his car, we start a call as well. Sure. Yes, we're going to take anonymous. What called Tembisa? Do you anonymous? Hello, Mama. Le Rona le kai Mama. Rona. Rona pa lo bo le Rona Mama. Okay, I'm in that situation right now. Hmm. Even in that kid, he hit me, and my kid is not working now. Hmm. Mama. Mama. Hello, Mama. Rona pa lo kore on on kote se le marking my kuto hao. And the whole of South Africa, so that your voice can be heard, Mama. situation. Eh. I I I I Before I was married, the marriage was done, was born. Then I had to demand the whole thing for my child. She sure. complaining for that. Okay. Uh, anonymous, I hope you will learn that William is a, is a clinical psychologist and perhaps I can hear you too, sir. Just a little bit. Tate William. Um, ma, for how long has this going on? Yeah, microphone, please. <laughs> Okay. It's for two years now. For two years now. Uh, yes, I'm 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 social workers community center la Yes, I have been in that situation. 
ukazuyema ngizocela ma ukuthi please try ukuthi ifu ungakhona uhlambo kwe community center ungazama ukuthi mhlambu uyenkonzweni i think ukuzoba khona umuntu ongakusiza lapho omhlambe mangabe khona isocial worker eyazwa endaweni uzama ukuthi uye khona i think kuzoba ngcono lapho and mangabe ukuthi iqhubeka ngendlela iqhubeka ngayo lento ngiyacela ma ukuthi uzama ukuthi uthole i protection order or i restraining order ema poison um na wazokwazi ukuthi mhlamba ke referral to social worker or at least a psychologist engakwazi ukuthi ikusize ma ungahlali uwedwa la phendlini lento ukudle uwedwa sezwana ma ke khona uthama wa wa sakhona uthama ya uswaka umpetile mova Okay. Ma ngizo cela ukuthi makuphela le show ngizo share ama number swami kuma producers. Um ngicela ukuthi ufonele ke lo number le ukuthi sikwazi ukukhuluma kabanzi ngokwenza kalayo ukuthi ukwazi ukuthola usizo. Oh, are you going to out there so like what we'll do is as the show re tlanka di number tsa hao ne and then we'll try and get you in contact le to so like we talk ang I mean, that's that's the reality of South Africa right now. Tate Tepo, you wanted to say something, and we're going to pull a horn. Tate Tepo, you are the uncle, you are the young lady, Alin Karawa Mukwena, at the office, also at the hands of a man. You wanted to respond to Tate Muloi. Yeah, and Tate Muloi, I must congratulate you, Ohre. You are coming out that you have once abused. Um, I've never abused a woman. And maybe, again, it is a very wrong statement to go on national television and say all men are broken. Mm -hmm. Some of us are not. And the question was raised that what is it that we do? You know, two years ago, I started a program called uh, the Boys to Men um, Career Path and Mentoring. Mm -hmm. I, t I take young boys um, from grade 9, 10, and 11. I bring them to Houting and I mentor those boys. And this program is so huge mm. because uh, these are the boys raised without father figures. Mm. So the most important thing that I want to ask you is, I can see that you are emotional. I can see that you are angry. No, he's not. And it's good. He's saying oh, you can okay, come you, He's not. Believe me, trust yeah. me. But maybe we must touch the nerve. Mm. And my question to you is, you haven't touched the nerve. If you have abused and you were angry, what exactly made you angry? Something has made you angry. So we need to know what made you angry so that we can address okay. the problem. As um, as you have only just um, under a minute yes. to, to answer that question. I, I repeat. It doesn't really help me to come here and try to justify what made me happy. We'll all come with excuses. Mm. My father this, my mother this, and everything. Mm. The government this mm. is to take responsibility of the act that has gone through. Mm. So to come and say I'm angry, I'm no longer angry. If you know me, we we'll speak realities. Right now, this is a right example of this woman who's crying, mm. who's been abused. Mm. Have you asked yourself a question? Why do we have m more women in our churches than men? Yeah. Because they are victims mm. of the very same men who are not in the church. Mm. You go to, 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 to Jewish men in the church more than women. Mm. You go to Muslim men in the church more than, more than women. You go to the Arabs men in the church more than women. What is happening? South Africans, um, thank you for saying not generalizing. I'm not generalizing. Generalization is associated with stupidity. Mm -hmm. But I'm saying to you, 99% of South African men, even if you have not touched, you have not seen, but we are broken in some level. Whatever is happening, even our politicians are beating their wives, are beating women, mm. the leadership. So the whole country needs to go back and say, we are an angry women. Right now, we, we are angry men. Right now, what is happening in South Africa, it's an emotional revolution. Okay. After this, it will be psychological and physical. So, okay. tactical is Well, in Maybe when I now change of Mukwen with no no, maybe I'm not broken. Maybe tell us that as well. Give us a call, says Utumbona Kutin or Tolin Kunjanzo Kumana Sam and say breaking sabo.
Welcome back to Daily Tetan. Zero blah blah. Leban na lkhulu maga Daily Tetan. Nyoko chiba khor na abuse yo ya bon na kuvla maga bon na kuchwa kai. Is it because South African men are broken? And perhaps maybe kini we need to challenge a little bit more. We need to ask the right questions now in the segment to finish off the conversation. Nyoko chiba khor na what? How do we move forward? Because the problem is that we now need to move forward. And in our moving forward, rukwe lese sor na walla. Ralla. She's not the only person who's crying. You, you know, um, on that one, I have something because Usia next to me, we were talking, one killer something, but not only men are broken because Aban basically Sabaning, they are raised by these women. Mm. The society itself is broken. Mm. I don't know. Yeah. Uh, so, my, my submission to the conversation would be quickly that, you know, when you talk about a man, you need to know what a man is. Before I was broken, yeah. you know, as a whole, in contrast to being, uh, uh, to being broken. So what I'm saying is that the society itself, it, it, it is not men that are broken, but the society. Because I'll ask you a question now. Who raises the killer? Who raises the abuser? Mm -hmm. You'll find out that some of them were raised by single mothers. Some yeah. of them were raised by both parents, yeah. but still they are abusers. Mm. You know, and, and it, it, it is as though these days that everyone knows what it means to be a real man except mm. for the man himself you go to church they tell you that you're not a real man until you marry mm. a white wedding charismatic churches mm. tradition tells you that you are not a man until you go spend five weeks in the bush mm. you come back and the media tells you if you don't have six pack a dark and tall you are not a man mm. feminism, feminism tells you that you you are, you 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 are trash mm. you know everyone else intimate partners a uh, post uh, uh, potential partner tells you that because you are not working mm. you don't have a right to have an erection mm. so there's all this expectation that goes around with being a man mm. but the real issue here it is the society that is broken it is not only men men are broken yes but they only represent in their reflection of a broken and a harmed and harmful society and the society is made up of men women and all other all other uh, uh, sexualities that we have so until we deal with that mm. We can, we can come here and debate and say everything that we are going to say. But I'm telling you now, there is a boy that is denied to see his father by the mother because there are issues between them. Mm. What are you going to say to that boy when they grow up? You are going to say, no, they're coming with an excuse. It's not an excuse. Mm. There's that a is girl the reason. that's also being denied the it same is, opportunity, it, but they it she is. doesn't beat that's up. That's why I'm saying to you, we, 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 we must not be emotional when we talk about this. We must be rational and be open-minded. Mm. It is, is the society. Can I, can I come in there, Sia? The society. Can I just quickly come in there, Sia? You see, you see. Sia, help me come in there. Okay. It's very difficult for a man to tell a woman who's being beaten up day in, day out, not to be emotional. This is an emotional issue. You see, you now, can ask us to be as rational as possible, but when a man is lifting his hand and hits you, it becomes emotional. That is why this conversation will never go anywhere. Because we are dealing with symptoms, we are not dealing with the root cause of the problem. But it creates so, an emotional issue. So, how are we expecting people so, to deal I with I don't know if I should, if, if, if I should, if I no, should no, no, to you. I think because of, because of time, yes. this is a cool one. Nicola, can you quickly go to a social yes. and check it? Duva Lawrence, our culture in most communities is that men must ask other men for advice and if most men are broken you can only imagine what kind of advice becomes doctrinal amongst the men eventually society standards are defined by these unchecked conversations men have uh, look, Nicolette, I think we are dealing with a situation where we miss the, 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 the understanding behind the issue of abuse and everything. Are, are we leveling in this case? Okay. We are dealing in our identity as men. We are dealing with men and males, right? And now, I don't think a man has the ability in himself to abuse or to kill somebody. But the male can do that because the male gravitate on power mm. that is why when you see how males behave nowadays he goes from one woman to another mm. just because of power there is something that he needs to medicate in him he wants to get money so he can buy all the cars mm. so that he can attract something that actually validates his identity that's why when he he gets involved with a woman yeah. and then she takes the money or else he gives her the money then when she takes it, it feels like you've taken a part of me therefore i'm going Pastor, to abuse you on of that. Time, it's been a pleasure